my mate Ben, he uh, he likes these when they're made by Barco. This one's not made by Barco. This one's made by Tower and Leon Company. Uh, it happens to be American, and it's called the Cyclops. Doesn't have the same hole as a Barco has, or indeed a Faithful. A Faithful has a hole like that there. Uh, New York, there. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to guess that the uh, the bolt on the head isn't original. Didn't see that in the picture. Got that? Although, who's to say? Because it's got the same sort of fucking rust on it as the rest of it. But I'm going to say that bolt's not original. And that should be a pin. But there we are. And then we look at the jaw. Tiny little jaw there. Love tiny. Oh, God, it is tiny, isn't it? So, you put it on the floor. And you put it on the nail. And you, uh, and you leave her. And you leave her, right? It's very old. It's so old, right? It's so old. Look at that, there's the date in there. It was patented in Octo on October the 13th, 1891. 130 years ago. Then it was patented again, September the 6th, 1898. December the twelfth, eighteen ninety nine. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with that. This is uh, quite lovely and smooth in there. I'm gonna go with this is over a hundred and hundred and twenty years old. Well, I had a plan for this, but now it's arrived. I'll have to come up with a different plan because. It's a bit too nice to uh, to not restore properly. So, okay. It's got a patent date, but it hasn't got a patent number. Okay. It's a shame about that, I mean... It does look so old. I think if we run this nut and bolt past the belt sander, we should be able to make something good out of it. and cut it down to a decent length. And it's going into a soak of deoxy overnight to get rid of all the rust on the inside. Right, this is 12 hours later, come out of the deoxy, give it a dry off, giving it a rub, so you know, clean it will come up before it goes onto the wire wheel.
I do love wire wheeling anything that's been in deoxy. It just comes up so well, so easily. So quickly back to what it looked like originally and what it looks like now. Rub a good old dollop of earwax all over it, give it a protective coat. It's about two months worth of saved up earwax here I'll put on this. Oh, I think we can say that pin's an improvement over what it started off as. In hindsight, this side I could have cut the uh, nut in half and had that half as thick, but oh well, it's better, isn't it? So um, I think we can call that done. Right, that's all for today. Don't forget, every now and again, check out the Handy Dad Workshop channel. My other channel where I do reasonably quiet restores. Don't do much talking, just get on with it. As well as helpful things like 
how to fix your telly when the Wi-Fi don't work, and how to fix your aircon in your car. Right, bye for now.